guys. So these are the flavors here that they have. Oh dang, guys, it's loaded. This is where all the magic happens in the back here. So let's see what the guys got going on back here. Welcome back to another Jerry's Family Vlog video. It's your girl, Jen. Your boy, bro. And today we are headed to Delicioso Coco Helado. What else better way to do it in the Bronx and go get some frozen ices, right? So we actually found this spot right here in the Bronx. This spot is actually pretty viral. So it's basically the spot where a lot of the um, Spanish people, as you know, in the Bronx go to get ices. So they have many different flavors. I'm excited to go see what else they have. So we had to wake up a little bit early and try to get there because the yeah. place opens at nine, but we probably anticipating the line when we get there. So yeah. hopefully enjoy this video. And hopefully enjoy your day. Love you guys. If you're new to our channel, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. To the Jarvis family. Yes, sir. So let's see what they got up in. Hopefully you get a chance to pull up yourself. All right, y'all, we made it. And to our surprise, there's a line. Ooh. Fantastic. That's because Jazz took my loan to get He's ready, man. He's lying. He's well, lying. We expected a line. We're not sure if they even accept oh. um, Apple Tap or uh, Swipe, but not really sure. So check the line out. Hmm. It's a lie, guys. Are you a meal? I mean, they usually have like a sign with all the flavors on it, but I don't see it at the moment. But when we do see it, we'll let y'all look at it. Jazz over there scoping, scoping. I think a lot of these people be like vendors. A lot of these guys probably um actually sell icy. They might actually be some of the guys in your local community. It's only one thing I want to know. Are y'all selling them joints $2, $3? What happened to a dollar, dollar fifty? And just to that? think, I think the tubs here are going for about $7. So yes. I don't know what flavors they have, but we were trying to pick up at least two or three flavors. All right, guys, so the line is moving. Comment down below. What's your favorite flavor? Coco mango cherry? Jazz said she liked that time out of Eno Jane. Yes, I think that's the best. I don't know. I think the mango one is the best. I don't know. Mm. Comment down below, which I think is one of the better flavors. I don't know that. I wonder if they got some limbe in there. Coco is good too. No? No. No limbe? No limbe. Oh, no limbe in there. Damn. This is sort of kind of the I want to know if it's authentic. They said it's handmade. Like I said, it's a lot of people here that's probably um, local vendors, the people that work these areas. They're giving out bags. Like you said, how much, how much they want you to load up. So it should be interesting. Yeah. Nope. Sometimes you gotta give the elderly a chance. Stop. Summer's almost over, guys. You're ready to send those kids back to school? Yes. yes. You're ready to do um, some school shopping in the mall? No. Nope. And all the kids are gonna show up on the first day with the same sneakers, I bet you, man. Same sneakers, same book bags. You think so? Yeah, a lot of them all. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, I, I believe that. I do believe that. We might just send Stephanie to school with one of those um, book bags from the church. Oh, no. My God. She would kill us. Mm -hmm. No. <laughs> no. Save, save some fun. I know he's lying. Okay. Ain't a lot. We was talking about actually taking these ices and going to one of our local parks and then give out the ices yeah, like just as a giveaway. Good. But maybe next time, man. Yeah, we maybe definitely next. do like a giveaway. Definitely, um, just to give back to the neighborhood and the community or whatever. Yeah, absolutely. And we have to be very well prepared. So. Yeah. So next time, we definitely gonna try something yes. in the future. So stay tuned, man. Maybe it'll be like a. Not the end of the summer. I'm not gonna guarantee it this summer, but maybe next summer. Maybe. Yeah, let's see how big the tubs are and like what we could do with it as far as like the giveaway. But that'd be dope, though. Yes. I think they only let in a few people at a time, though. Um, so we'll see. Well, says he wants to know coming up. I was expecting a line to be um, down the block and around the corner. A lot of the vlogs we saw before, the lines were so long, like long, like past the block long. Okay. Yeah, so whenever you come, make sure you try to, you know, get here before 9 and expect a line if you do, you know, don't get there at that time frame. Yeah, so or they might actually be sold out so, for some of the flavors, so yes. that's why you have to come early. The earlier, the better. And they open at 9 a.m., so don't forget. And it's over here on 163rd and 3rd Avenue in the Bronx. Okay. Yes. So 
we'll right link, now, right. <laughs> we'll link the address down below. And if you ain't feeling safe, don't worry. It's a police precinct behind. Right. So don't worry. You'll be fine. Just be careful, man. This is where the drillies is at. We definitely on uh, the Seth side. <laughs> we fall. We fall from RPT. Oh gosh. No, stop it. You'll be fine. Trust me, you'll be fine. All right, guys. So these are the flavors here that they have. So they got blue raspberry, blue raspberry bubblegum, blue raspberry grape. They got cherry. They got mango. They got chocolate, coconut, coconut cherry, mango, coconut pineapple cherry. Cotton candy, well, I never heard of that one. A grape, green apple, lemon, lime, mango, orange, passion fruit, pineapple, pineapple, lime, pink lemonade, rainbow, sour, soft, um, strawberry, banana, strawberry, lemon, Swedish fish, oh, that's crazy. Tamarindo, tamarindo, mango, uh, tutti frutti, oh, snap. <laughs> and watermelon, oh, that's fucking. Comment down below, guys, if you see any flavors that you like. So they actually, um, take cash and Zelle pay so yeah. they don't accept time we kind of made our decision so stay tuned we show y'all when we get what we got we're gonna show you some of the other flavors and what else they got going on up there and right here in uh delicioso coco helado yeah what she said next guys oh my gosh oh they loaded in that shopping cart right there dang it's mad at what yeah. they should have got the whole shopping cart Oh, maybe they're going to get money. Oh, dang, guys, it's loading. Oh, right, we made it. Wow. All right, guys, so we made it inside. So this is actually some of the flavors they got here in their freezer, which is pretty cool. So I see they actually got tubs of coconut, mango. See, I wasn't sure how the mixed flavors would be. So this is like rainbow and stuff like that. So that's pretty cool. And then they got a lot of cups and stuff like that. So if you want to come and get some stuff to vent, I mean, you can. They have a lot of stuff in here you can vent in. I mean, they got a lot of stuff from people over there that work, I guess, trying to be like vendors and stuff like that. That's pretty cool. I'm assuming this is where all the magic happens in the back here. So let's see what the guys got going on back here. So she got like tamarino and I think we got cherry. Let's stay tuned to show you what we got making out of it. So the cup is pretty big. I was expecting them to be small, like I was saying. I, I was expecting like, smaller tubs and they also have like those five gallon tubs if you want them also so that's pretty good so we set we all set so let's go guys that's so heavy so that's yeah, pretty cool man they, they actually take 12 pay so if you want and they take cash so it actually was 21 even seven dollars a tub so that's pretty dope do you want to show them what we got here or you want to wait for i can show them what we got all right, so let's see what Jazz got in her bag of goodies. Frio, 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 frio. Look at my bag. All right. Man, so these I got, things is heavy, man. We got a tamarindo. We got a cherry. Classic cherry. Yes. And last but not least. I don't know if got, I can get to that last one. Uh, uh, it's right here, last but not least. These things is heavy, man. It's a mango. Yo, comment down below, guys, if y'all would have did something different. I don't know. Comment down below. What do you think? Well, me personally, I definitely would have did something different, but really like the basics, so. Yeah. I mean, we could have always switched it up and tried to do something else. So yeah, guys, so we just did the basics, which is cool. But um, the only reason why we did do the basics is because our daughter, she's very picky. Make sure you bring the boys with you. This thing is heavy, man, I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, bring, Three tubs bring is them in, heavy. <laughs> bring them in. <laughs> These things, this thing gotta be at least 30 pounds right here. Dang. By itself. Word, well, three tubs. And they're pretty big. That's why I was wondering. Even the five-gallon uh, tubs is pretty big. So yes. you definitely get your money's worth. And it's, it's hitting people over there li lining up. Yep. Jazz had a special. She had to yell it out on the radio. Tamarino. Hell yeah. Well, first of all, if you don't come here early for that tamarindo, that joint will be sold out ASAP. Yeah, most likely cherry and mango. But that's one of the flavors that a lot of the vendors buy anyway. So. Right. I'm just happy we was able to get here. The weather's actually, you know, lightening up. We've yes. been having rain every day. I know, At so one point, I was considering building the ark like Noah did. Oh my gosh. We got some good weather today, so. At least, thank God for that, yes. yes sir. So, we're gonna go home. We're gonna put these in the freezer. Down. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Hopefully you enjoyed your day. Stay tuned, we got some money videos planned for you guys. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. To the Jared's coming, yeah. Love you guys. See y'all. Tomorrow. Right now.